G'day, welcome to Todd's Kitchen. I've made a number of meatball recipes in the past and every single one of them has been absolutely delicious. But let's take it up to the next level and make it even better. So join me today as I make my version of a bacon cheeseburger meatballs. Now we're going to start this off by cooking a couple of ingredients. So first I have a fry pan on the stove on a medium to high heat. And to that I'm going to add in one chopped up onion. And it wouldn't be a bacon cheeseburger without the bacon. So I've got a few rashes of bacon here that I've also chopped up. And basically we're just going to stir fry the onion and the bacon until the onion has caramelized and the bacon is nice and crispy. Next into a mixing bowl I'm going to place in our ground beef or minced meat depending on which country you're from. And to that some breadcrumbs and I'll leave a list of ingredients in the description below just so you know the exact amounts. Next one egg and being a bacon cheeseburger meatball the cheese. And lastly assuming it all survived between the pan and the bowl of course, our bacon and onion. Then using clean hands or hands with gloves, give it a good mix through until it's completely combined. Now lastly just add some salt and some pepper and just mix through to combine. Now once it's combined it's just a simple matter of grabbing our meat ball size. So it's up to you the size that you want to make. I'm just going to make a standard type size one like so. Now I have a baking dish. Now what I've done is I've steamed some sweet potato, mashed it up and just placed it on the base. And of course you can also use normal potatoes if you choose. So all we have to do is just place our meatballs onto our prepared base. Now once done we're going to place this into a preheated oven at 180 degrees celsius or 350 degrees fahrenheit for about 30 minutes. And at 30 minutes, just to be on the safe side, just to open one up and make sure it's cooked all the way through. Now while the meatballs are in the oven, we're just going to make a quick glaze. So with half a cup of tomato sauce or ketchup, I'm going to add two tablespoons of brown sugar. Let's give that a very good mix, just like that. And we're just going to place that in the microwave for about 30 seconds, just to warm it up. And we're going to mix it again, just until the sugar is dissolved. Now I've just taken our meatballs out of the oven. All that's left now, is just to apply some of our tomato sauce glaze. And they're ready to serve. Now you can have them as is, or you can have them with a side of vegetables. It's completely up to you. And this recipe is easily duplicated. You can actually double the recipe and just use a dish that's twice the size. So it is a very versatile recipe. It is a very easy recipe. And apart from the bread, they taste exactly like bacon cheeseburgers. And if you've ever had a bacon cheeseburger before, you know they taste simply delish. So for something completely different, but fantastic, add this to your dinner list because the family will love it. Thank you for watching this episode of Todd's Kitchen. As always, I'll leave a list of ingredients down below as well as links to my Facebook, Twitter, Instagram and Home Handy Hints channel. And please do me a massive favour by giving this video a thumbs up, leave a comment and subscribe and I'll see you next time for another delicious recipe.